know what you're thinking. Professional video games? Seriously? Well, yeah. This is serious business. Get that image of a soda-chugging, frozen pizza-eating geek who never leaves his bedroom out of your head. When I was about 14, I first realized I could, I could be a professional gamer. Many people would call competitive gaming or esports a subculture, but is it really when it packs this stadium for two days, 15,000 people all here to watch their favorite players compete in the North American finals of League of Legends, currently the most played video game in the world. Players make millions and travel on international athlete visas. ESPN and TSN both cover esports now. from part-time gamer to professional competition. The lucrative worlds of professional sports and competitive video gaming are beginning to merge with the NBA's Philadelphia 76ers becoming the first organization among the four major U.S. sports leagues to invest in so-called e-sports squads. He is unparalleled in the sports world. You at home can compete against players across the region at these iconic games. Rocket League. Street Fighter, CSGO. Validation, I think we have all the validation from the fans that we need. Fans for whom speed and agility are just as impressive on a video game screen as they are on a court or racetrack. Like, there is no surprise anymore. The, the numbers make sense and they're big. So whenever I hear a stat, I just kind of like nod, give a little wink and chuckle because it's just going to get bigger. Like, we've just barely scratched the surface.